Hey, what is up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to install and use Xbox Game Bar on your Windows 10 PC to capture gameplay footage completely free. Okay, so Xbox Game Bar is a free to use piece of software which enables you to capture your gameplay videos with sound in 60 FPS and it even shows a cool performance widget at the bottom of your screen if you enable it. Okay, so to begin with what we're going to do, we're going to go to the Microsoft Store and then in the search bar, we're going to type in Game Bar. Alright, so as you can see, it says Xbox Game Bar, and it's free. So if you just click on that, on the top right section here, it will say Install on this blue button here. So just click on that and make sure that Xbox Game Bar has been installed. Once you come back to the screen, if it says Launch, it means it's worked. Okay, and the next thing you need to do is just restart your computer just to make sure that everything has gone smoothly. After installing it and after restarting your computer, if you come back here, click on launch, it should load up the application. All right, so now that you've got Xbox Game Bar installed, we need to configure that in the settings options. So what you need to do is if you click on the search icon, just type in settings and click on the icon for settings. You can also click on your start menu and find the settings icon, which is a cogwheel. Click on that. Make sure it loads up this screen. Then if you see down here at the bottom left, it says gaming and it will also mention Xbox Game Bar. So just click on this. Now you need to click on the captures section over here. And over here, it tells you where all the screenshots and game clips are saved in. So obviously you can change this if you've got multiple drives. You can select another hard drive if you wanted to. If we just scroll down, it also tells you the maximum recording length. If I click on this drop down, it does show you can actually go up to four hours if you wanted to. If you check this button here, you can also record the audio of the game. You can also turn on the mic by default. So every time you start recording, it will also record from your mic as well. The audio quality you can change and it goes up to 192 kbps. Obviously, for mine, I've set all this to low because I'm using another piece of software to capture my gameplay and capture all this footage right now. For the recorded video, this is the most important bit. So what you'll find is by default, it's set to 30 FPS. So what you need to do is just change this to 60 FPS. So then you'll get all the good 60 FPS footage and change the video quality to high. So what you might find that is it's set to 30 FPS and video quality is set to standard. So just change that to 60 and high quality. All right, so once you've done that, we can move on to the actual gameplay. Now, I'm gonna show you an in-game example of how to start your recording, how to enable the widget, and how to get things going with Xbox Game Bar. All right, so we are now inside a game, and after you have installed Xbox Game Bar, what you need to do, if you just press the Windows key and G at the same time, it should load up a screen like this and as you can see i've got an audio section here i've got the menu bar here capture section here and a performance section as well if you click on fps here and we just pin it to the background so when, once you exit out of the screen it will show you the performance and you can have a look how your game is performing if you don't see all of these things basically what that means is that these widgets have been closed down and you just have to click on these uh, buttons here on the top to re-enable them. So as you can see, I've just clicked on the performance button there and just brought this in there. You can also move this around wherever you like. It's really cool. Just drag and drop it. So let's pin it back there. And I'm just going to click on the record button here. So as you can see, when I hover over this, it says start recording. Now, I am using a different application to record this, so that's why I've muted it. But you can also enable your mic so that when you use this application, you can also record audio alongside. So I'm just, just gonna click on record. And as you can see, the capture status is showing and I'm just gonna move it down here, just so it's nice and neat. You can also move it up on the top or anywhere else where you want to. All right, let's move it back down here. All right, so to get out of the screen, if you press the Windows key and press G, at the bottom there, you'll see I've got my performance stats showing and I've also got the record status so if we just play a bit of this game as you can see the FPS is changing it's telling me how much CPU I'm using as well 
and tablets and GPU I'm using. As you can see, I'm using 100% GPU because this game is quite GPU hungry. And I'm also using the CPU 70%, around 70 to 80%. And as you can see, I'm getting 72 to 75 FPS in this area. Obviously, when I go to the city, it might drop down a bit. So yeah, all you need to do is after you've installed the Xbox Game Bar, just press the Windows and G buttons and as you can see over here, it will give you all the options. Now I'm just going to stop this recording. If you are in the game, you won't be able to click on the stop button. So you do have to press the Windows key and the G button at the same time and you can just click on stop over here and it will say game clip recorded. And after it's done that, if you go to your this PC folder, and click on videos and then go to the captures folder all your games all your gameplay videos will be saved in this location hope you guys have found this video useful if you have please give us a like if you have any comments or queries please leave them in the comment section below please subscribe to this channel to help support it help it grow and thank you for watching